This video is sponsored by Polar Pro. Hello beautiful people. Today's video is for all my iPhone photographers, people who love to take photos on your phone. And the phones have advanced so far, so you can really take epic photos on your phone. But there's a few things that you can do to really make this process even better. And I'm really stoked because my friends at Polar Pro just sent me the Light Chaser Pro. This is the photographer kit that comes with the case, grip, and a circular polarizer. And a circular polarizer for your phone will change your phone photos. So I'm gonna talk a bit about what that will do, but just let me lock my door first. You know, safety first, kids. Okay, let's go. All right, so why do you even need a circular polarizer? Well, the thing that is awesome about them is that they deepen colors, they reduce glare and reflections, and they get rid of haze in your photos. Now, this is important for any kind of photos that you take, but it is very important Sorry, just eyes on the road, people. It is very important for phone photography because phones often suffer from those problems. So I'm gonna go find a spot to take some fun pictures and we'll test it out. All right, so here's a really good example of how reflections can impact your photo, especially when you don't want the reflections happening. Now, you know, you always have your phone on you. So whether you're trying to document a cool place or you just wanna take a cool photo, going through windows and things like that can be a bit of a challenge. So for instance, with this one, um, if I want to take it this way, you're going to see just right out of the camera, we have a ton of reflections happening. But now if I take the Polar Pro filter, I'm just going to attach that right onto the camera here. Fits right on onto the case and then we have the little grip here. So then what we're going to do is we're just going to move the polarizer around until we get rid of that reflection. So see there is the reflection happening. When we just adjust the polarizer, we can just take away all of that glare. The other thing that's great about having a circular polarizer is that it really deepens the colors. It makes things a lot richer and just kind of makes them pop a lot more. So for landscapes, it's great because it's gonna bring out the blues in the sky, bring just a lot more depth to your photos. Now, we are going to go back home because it's like minus 10 degrees and I am freezing and I'm cold and my hand has frostbite. So we're done with the outside portion of this video. Let's go back. All right, so we're back inside and I had a chance to warm up, so now I can actually talk about what you get in the kit. Now, this is the Light Chaser Pro kit. I have the photography kit. And what comes with that is the case and the grip. And this is actually one of my favorite parts about this whole kit because I often just struggle with how I hold my phone when I take photos with it. I just find it really awkward, especially if you actually have a camera and you're used to using that, then when you actually go and take photos with your phone, it's not so much the quality of the phone photos because they're actually great. It's just the whole thing of like holding a tiny little phone camera and it doesn't feel great. So this comes with the case and then you have the grip. The grip is really easy to use and the thing that's great about it is that there's all these notches on the case so you can place it where is best for you. This middle notch here will actually let the phone stand on its own so you can go like that and if you were recording a video or just wanted to do like a long exposure or something, you could do it like that. This I also find is the easiest way to actually hold the phone to take photos. It makes it really easy whether you're doing it landscape or if you're switching into portrait, you can just hold it like that, double tap, it makes it really, really easy. Now, when I got the case, there was a little info graphic card with it, and they said that if you have large hands, then to use this last notch here on the end. So I guess if you just want like a long grip, I'm not using that one, but if that is a problem that you have, you can use it. So there you go, you just notch that right on and you're good to go. So the grip in the case, I think is absolutely amazing. And then what you get is the circular polarizer. This is what you get in the photography kit. If you wanna go for the filmmaker kit, then you can get ND filters or you can just buy them separately. Um, but in this one, you get the circular polarizer. It's just in there like that. So we'll just pop that out. And then it actually has the Defender case on it. So what you can do when you put this onto your phone, just find the little notches there and it just 
goes like that right in. You could actually just leave the Defender case right on your phone, throw it in your bag or your pocket or whatever, and then you have the circular polarizer right on it, and then you can just take off the Defender cap, and there you go, you're good to go. Now, with the circular polarizer, like we said, we showed you in some of those examples, it is going to work for reducing glare, reflections, and deepening colors. That's really what it's gonna do. So it's just a great thing to add on to your basic iPhone photography workflow. If you wanted to take things to the next level, then you'd wanna order some of those ND filters from Polar Pro as well. So if you guys want to check out the photography kit of the Light Chaser uh, Pro selection from Polar Pro, click that link down in the description below and you can check it out and learn more about it. If you guys want some more videos on phone photography and phone editing, definitely let me know. I'm not sure if that's something that you want, but a bunch of people have been asking about it lately, so I'd be happy to either do tutorials on actually taking photos on your phone or using your phone to edit awesome photos so if you have ideas for that help me out leave them in the comments down below and who knows maybe I'll do one of your ideas all right like subscribe hit that bell and I will see you guys next week peace out